Hey guys, this is Mr. Pogzamar and today I'm gonna teach you how to spawn the cannon villager in Minecraft Pocket Edition So for us to spawn the cannon villager, we need to build first a machine like this. I call this the cannon villager machine. And we will need the following items. Stone bricks, resin torch, resin dust, button, resin repeater, dispenser, anvil, and grass block. So all we have to do first is to uh, dig a hole on the ground and it must be 3 by 3 uh pretty much like this and uh, what we're going to do is to uh, put wall it must be uh, three blocks high make sure uh, there are three walls and uh, make sure uh, the fourth one is actually open so this is the fourth wall it's gonna be open next we're gonna put here uh, the button and we will actually dig so up to two blocks deep uh, from here going to this direction there we go now uh, let's dig uh, somewhere here all right there we go so that we can actually move now we will put here another block and of course redstone dust and then at the back uh, we will put the redstone torch now here uh, we will dig uh, two times there we go and then we will actually uh, go here so i will get rid of this first uh, the block at the middle we will put there a command block so uh, we will now get the command block so for us to get it uh, we're going to type here slash give at p and then it must be a command underscore block there we go so there's my command block so we're gonna put uh, one command block right there so we can now uh, close it and then here we will put a redstone repeater and then uh, we will change the delay up to maximum there we go then we will tap the command block and then we will put here uh, summon so we don't need a slash anymore so we have a summon make sure your spelling is correct and then it must be Raijen. I think this is the creator of this uh, add-on. So I'm going to leave the link for this add-on in the description down below. So again, uh, you need to uh, put the command. It must be summon Raijen and then colon canon underscore villager. And here we go. Again, uh, let's check if the spelling is correct. I guess it is. So let's now uh, go here and then uh, let's try to dig somewhere here going this way. We will actually put uh, two more command blocks. So the first one, I'm going to type here uh, kill at E. It must be at, there we go, at E and then bracket type equal and then villager. There we go and then bracket again so make sure the spelling is correct and then uh, just leave it as it is uh, let's have the next one make sure it's uh, pointing this way the arrow must be pointing this way there we go and then uh, we're going to type here uh, fill and then we will uh, get uh, some coordinates so we will actually go back here and we will get some coordinates so the first one will be here so I'm going to put a block right there and I'm going to break it so my coordinates are actually 46 4 and negative 22 so uh, you just need to write this down so me I have a paper and pencil with me right now so that I can write and then uh, another uh, coordinates will be here so mine is a uh, 48 6 and uh, negative 24 
So again, you will have your own uh, different uh, setup coordinates uh, because that's how uh, the way it works. All right, so uh, let's now go back to the command block right here, the last command block that we place on the ground. So we're going to type here the coordinates. So the first one, mine is 46, 4, and then uh, negative 22. There we go. And then the second coordinates, uh, mine is uh, 48, 6, and then a negative 24. And then we're gonna fill this area with air. There we go. Now change the block type to chain and then redstone always active. Uh, the command block must be green, just like that. And uh, we will now close everything, cover everything with grass block again. There we go. And then it's now time for us to uh, make uh a cannon here build a cannon so we're gonna need an anvil so just place it here it must be facing that way and then dispenser for the cannon so it will look like cannon up to three blocks going this way there we go and uh we need a command again this time we will give the player or yourself so give at p and then this time we're gonna type barrier okay make sure the spelling is correct there we go so just press next it must be here there we go there's the barrier block and uh, let's now put a uh, one here and another one here there we go so we have now the cannon as you can see this is the cannon so we just need uh, to spawn the villager all right so i have here the villager egg so i'm gonna spawn the villager somewhere here it doesn't matter uh whatever is the profession of the villager it uh this machine will work regardless and then let's now try if this machine is really working so we have the cannon plus the villager and then of course the result is a cannon villager i don't like raining so we have their uh, clear weather all right so let's now push the button let's uh, first clear the inventory there we go i also have here the husk egg and let's see if the cannon villager will actually attack uh, hostile mobs let's see uh, first we need to push the button and let's see what will happen so one two three there we go what happened oh my goodness I think we need to change something. Alright, so uh, what we're going to do is to go here in this command block. So we did not type uh, the coordinates. So uh, we should use this symbol right here. The second one must have two and then this one. So I forgot. Let's now replace this with iron block. Alright, so this is now take two. So we have now our very new cannon here and of course the villager. And let's see what will happen hopefully uh, this time it will work so let's now push the button there we go and as you can see we have now the cannon villager oh my goodness let's see if the cannon villager will attack the husk so we have here the husk as you can see oh my goodness it's aiming for it there we go oh my goodness it's attacking the the hus oh my goodness this is definitely working oh it even ruined the machine oh my goodness this is so cool so i hope you enjoyed make sure to subscribe leave a like and comment down below thank you so much for watching have you ever felt are you listening damn Yeah.